everyone, it's Liz. Here we are for your outdoor run this week. Put me on pause if you're still getting ready and come back when you're ready to roll. All right, so here we go. You are walking as I speak to you about your instructions on your outdoor run today. Start walking off, start off walking slow. You can pick up your pace as you go. Of course, when I'm done, you can stretch some more, walk longer, whatever feels good for your warm up. So the run today, you're gonna have the option to do both, um, both parts of this or just to stop after the first section. So it depends on how much time you have. Each section is about 17 minutes long. So one part of the workout will be a 17 minute workout. And if you put them both together, it'll be a 34 minute workout. Totally up to you how you wanna do it. So you're gonna make your way to flat terrain. That's our goal is to run on flattish terrain. That's not always easy. So just do your best to find what you can. And once you get there, you are going to just take note of your um, watch or your phone clock or whatever, and you are going to run at a conversational jog pace or a base pace, if you will, for five full minutes. So just jogging for five minutes, something you can sustain for the five minutes at a conversational pace. So if you're not running with someone to conversate with, definitely, again, like I've been saying, try to just say some words out loud without being too breathy. After you hit that five minutes, you go directly into a sprint, okay? Sprinting's hard, especially when you're just out in the middle of the great outdoors, but it's gonna be a full, full push pace, okay? So maybe it's not a 10 out, it's not a 10 out of 10 pace, but you're up there in like the eight, nine, 10 out of 10 pace. So full sprint only for 20 seconds. So you run the five minutes and you'll go directly into sprinting for 20 seconds. As soon as your 20 seconds is up, you'll do a conversational pace again for four minutes. As soon as your four minutes is up, you'll do 20 seconds of sprinting. Right at the end of your 20 second sprint, you'll now run at a conversational pace for three minutes. At the end of three minutes, you'll do a 20 second sprint pace. At the end of that sprint, you will do a two minute conversational pace jog. At the end of those two minutes, you go directly into 20 second sprinting. At the end of the 20 second sprint, you'll jog conversationally for just one minute. At the end of the minute, you will go to 20 seconds of sprinting. This is where you get the option to stop, rest, recover, fully end the workout, totally up to you, or you can climb back up this ladder that you did and repeat what you just did, the one minute and the 20 second sprint. And then you'll go to the two minute conversational jog and the 20 second sprint, then the three minute and the 20 second sprint, then the four minute jog and 20 second sprint, and you will finish it off with a five minute jog and a 20 second sprint. So that's your option for today. Starting at five minute conversational jog, backing that up with a 20 second sprint. You'll move through four minute, three, two, and one minute conversational jogs. At the end of each of those conversational jog chunks, you do a 20 second sprint pace, okay? Again, you can just climb from the five minute to the one minute and be done. That's 17 minutes for you, more or less. Or you can climb back to the five minutes, starting at the one, to the two, three, four, and five minute conversational paces, of course, at the end, doing the 20 second sprinting, and that'll make it a nice full 34 minute running workout outdoors. Totally up to you how you want to do it. Um, again, once you finish the one section, you could also just rest, recover, maybe stretch, catch your breath, and then repeat that next part, whatever you have to do. But the full working phase of this will be approximately 34 minutes. All right, so keep warming up. It's only been about four minutes so far, not even that. So get a nice good warm up in before you go into your first conversational jog pace of five minutes. Um, if you are a walker or a walk jogger, very easy, just during the conversational jog walk, if you're that walker, or if you're a walk jogger, you can very easily go off and on with the walking and jogging, okay? Bikers, you can also use this for biking and just sprinting for those 20 seconds. Enjoy this time outside, breathe in that fresh air. Where I am, it's nice and brisk, so wherever you are, I hope you layer up perfectly. Enjoy the fresh air in those lungs like we have been, and yeah, just savor this out outdoor workout. Can't wait for your next outdoor workout next week. It'll be hills. Don't worry. Enjoy the flats. Love you guys. See you soon.